Well, hello dolls, and welcome to another day of Vlogtober. I don't like to do things just because everyone is doing them. I don't want to hop on the bandwagon. I want to do things in my own time, in my own way, for my own reasons. Sometimes the things I avoid the most end up becoming the things I am the most obsessed with and the most addicted to, and I think somewhere deep in my brain, uh, something in there knows exactly that that's what's gonna happen and that's why I avoid them. Things that I have avoided like the plague and then become addicted and obsessed with Twitter, Tumblr, because of Tumblr, BBC Sherlock, and Benedict Cumberbatch. I do not even want to tell you guys how much of my time is spent thinking about an older, unattainable British man. One thing that has been much hyped about that I have avoided so hard is the pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks. I love Starbucks and I drink quite a lot of it now that there is one directly across the parking lot from my office. It's 200 feet away so we be drinking a lot of Starbucks. Curiosity got the best of me the other day and I decided to give the pumpkin spice latte a whirl despite the fact that a coffee that tastes like pumpkin pie sounds completely disgusting and everybody freaks out about it and I just I don't want to I, I don't know, wanna, don't wanna be part of that. If you follow me on Twitter, you may have seen that I was unimpressed with the pumpkin spice latte. First few drinks, I'm like, oh, I mean, this tastes good, but I don't understand why people become obsessed. I don't get why people die when it gets re-released every year and then cry when it goes away. And then I took a few more sips. I thought, oh, okay, it, this is really quite good. And then I took a few more sips, and I'm like, okay, this is really dang good. I see why people get excited, but I don't see the obsession. Somewhere along the line, once I got to the bottom of that cup, I was hooked. And that was a week ago. I have had five pumpkin spice lattes. This, this right here is the fifth. See, pumpkin spice, three shots because today was a rough day. <sighs> Okay. And I just, I don't do that. Once or twice a week, maybe. Like, twice is pushing it. Five times in seven days. When I'm done with one, I want another one. And I think about when is the next time I can get one. In the days I haven't gotten one, I've literally been debating with myself for the whole day. I want one, but I shouldn't get one. I've already had too many. Blah, 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 blah. In my brain all day. Starbucks? What is in this drink? Is it crack? What What have you done to me? What have you done to the women of America? And I don't know, I don't know how popular pumpkin spice is and all the other Starbucks and all the places, but all I know is that all the girls here freak out and now I feel like I've become one of those girls. And I am dreading and wondering, well, when is this gonna go away? And how many can I get before it goes away? I have a problem and I need help, but I don't want help because it tastes so I feel so ashamed. I'm on the bandwagon. I want it hard. I, pretty soon I'm gonna be driving the bandwagon. Y'all. This is just what I've been thinking about for the past week. Is pumpkin spice lattes? And why didn't I just stay away? And why couldn't I have just thought it was disgusting? And why have I been wasting so much time not drinking it? Because it's freaking delicious. Stay away from the pumpkin spice latte. It is, it is not worth your time, and your money, and this heartbreak, this disgust. There are my ramblings for today. As always, thank you for watching. While some of this is certainly in jest, uh, for real, much love and much want for the pumpkin spice latte. And I would love to hear from you in the comments below. Do you drink it? When did you first try it? Uh, do you think it's worth the hype? Do you freak out? Tell me all of the pumpkin spice latte things. If you liked this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of this face and my pumpkin spice ramblings, make sure you hit the subscribe button. All of my links will be down below as well. I would love to see you in all of the internet places. And I will see you soon. Bye, dolls. I can't get over it. Oh, I can't, I can't want pumpkin spice. What is that noise? I am trying to film and this is like the 20th take and it's finally good and I just... Do you hear that? Do you hear what's happening outside?
Oh, so good, y'all. 